All right, good morning and welcome to this week's broadcast of the Breakthrough Deliverance Hour. We continue to broadcast to you the undiluted word of the living God. We continue to bring you uh, past sermons and messages because as you know, no church really in great session for us to do live on a break broadcast here. But nevertheless, we know you're being blessed by some of these um, old messages that we have uh, really, really spending um, to, to bring to you because we want to keep you alive, want to keep you well, want to keep you in the knowing, want to keep you blessed by these great messages in the midst of this COVID-19 crisis. Unfortunately, places like St. Catherine, where we know that the government has made a very, very ungodly decision, and I want to say that very clear and outright, to not allow the church um, to at least to meet in 10 or, or given the opportunity to, to go to worship on a Sunday is very unfortunate. But we pray that this decision will be overturned and changed and, and, and persons will be really be able to go and worship just like everybody cramming the towns and the cities. But nevertheless, that's not what we want. We want to work together with both government, state, church, everybody to stem the curve of this deadly virus in Jamaica. But today, I want to bring a word to you that will challenge your minds, challenge your spirit, because I remember when Moses left the people uh, for a while to go to God, they made images and worship idols, and, and that, that's the hallmark of people when, when, when they turn from God, and, and when things not working in their favor, and think they have to wait on, on God, they, they tend to turn to evil, and we see that is happening, where people are building and idolizing people in this world and in this country, and this is what this thing is leading to, the, the Antichrist and the world order, and we want to say, to you do not anger God do not turn away from your God wait on the Lord and let God give you his command and his directive my brothers and sisters do not this the opportunity of serving the living true God do not let anybody do not ask for Barabbas and kill Jesus in a time like this we all need the blood of Jesus and so I want to share this word with you this morning and pray that you will be encouraged to stick and stay and hold on to your faith and don't give up and don't turn and worship no idol remember we need your help to keep on the radio and on the television so if you can please call us take the numbers and take the banking information and please tuck in a love gift or see the pay to help us continue in a time of this crisis the church is also very much hard hit more than everybody anybody else maybe and so only you the people who are watching and who are being blessed can help to keep the church alive today. God has blessed you. Bless us. Sow a seed. Plant a seed. Amen. Praise God. Or sow a tithe and an offering to keep our radio and television going so that you can be blessed. Let's not waste no time. Let's run into this word and watch the word of God. Listen to the word of God. Share it and be blessed by it. In Jesus' name, let's go to church. Dead. Before this honor, don't anger God hallelujah you spend your money you sacrifice you pit me them food money go walk you up here and get the idol what you do here for me pray for you I feel like preaching to somebody they gave up their gold and their silver. They gave up their rings and earrings. What have you given up? A sacrifice against God. Every sacrifice you make to idol is a sacrifice against God. Death before this honor. Somebody better repent in here. Why oh, you not talk to me? Look for me funny like me afraid of your face. You come a fasting one man a God lay hand upon you. You come a church one man pray for you. You come a Reverend Stewart. Oh, looking at your life and tell you I go on. Well me I go tell you I go on. Get rid of the idol.
Your life will never be better. And no matter how my prayer, no prayer, no answer until you get rid. You look a family tradition. Can I preach to somebody? Can I preach to somebody? Touch your neighbor, say neighbor. If you have anything for Simon, carry back. If you have nothing for you, be a man. Every bath water. Every highland powder. Every ring gathering and chain. Every idol way up up. God see you. Oh, you don't want me to preach. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Here on. Set up the altar. Build the calf. Oh God. And he said, these are your gods. These are your gods. Everything where you have in your possession. That is not of God is your God. Everything where you have, I carry with you. Somehow you can't left if you're not beard in a lime juice. If you don't have nothing, leg, lime juice and kalanga mix up with whatever. Somehow you can't beard in your bathroom if you don't lock the door and fix up. You can't go road. If you're not going to fix up yourself, you're not chat to me. Somehow you can't say nothing. Because you're bad before you come out this morning and still say I come at church. The blood of Jesus is against you. The man tell you, say you can't leave it. Everywhere you go, you have to carry. Everything you do, you have to use it. You have to be a damn bar tonight. You have to wash it. You know what I'm preaching? Somehow you don't know use shower. You don't have to use bad pan. Because you have to throw things in it. Somehow you don't know shower no work. Because you have to be in a pan. For throw the same thing. Somebody there are guilty. You're guilty. How much you go spend. You never have no gold. You never have no silver. But you find the money. Fi go down as time man. Go wash your kin. You have the ring. You have the chain. You, where you doing it? Where you there? Where you never carry congi me? Where you hide it for? And come here. God see you. To trust God, some of you need to learn to wait on God. You're too mix up, you're too nasty, you're too evil, us. your mind too corrupt. Hallelujah! The Bible said, Take time with me, I feel the Holy Ghost here and here and when here and saw this, he built an altar in front of the cab and announce tomorrow there will be a festival touch your neighbor say neighbor cancel the festival cancel the festival you are got dead if you worship your idol god i got take you out touch your neighbor say no go at the festival Hope your people love a festival. Them love dance round their altar. We do not see them down The 61 order. The candle burner. Roman holy and nastiness. When you go in at some of them places. Where they say them a worship God. You see white rum. You see candle. 
somebody not like me. You see cup and saucer. You see basin with water. You know what me preach? And them a dance round the altar. Say neighbor, no go at the festival. Lord Jesus, they make them sacrifice before the altar. And them dance and them revel. Can I preach? We are worried about them in a Jamaica. Them put up flags. Say a church them a keep. But a revel them a revel. In a them harder. Lord oh, Jesus, oh be a worker, what he power oh, be a man, say them have church, them put up flag, you will see the base, them have the fire, them have some rum, all kind of nastiness, they have up in a day. Say a church, them a keep, and them a huma, and a huma, and a kuma, round there. Say neighbor, stay far from it, God will kill you, God will hurt judgment will reach you touch your neighbor say be careful which altar you are make your sacrifice pun be careful which altar you are sacrifice pun if it's not the altar of god no dance around it no carry your sacrifice to no idol somebody know how me preach seek ye first the kingdom of god and his righteousness and all other things shall be too much idol worship in a Jamaica. That's why so much blood around Paniland. The politician them want the murder because them in a harder. The blood shedding is a sacrificial blood letting to feed the demonic force. Somebody not talk to me. God allow it. No matter how we are pray, the plague of death is rocking the nation because the whole of them join up. The politician, the police, the doctor, and the parlor, them organize together. All of them are get a cut, but God allow it because it is sacrifice unto idol. Man are go dead. Blood are go run. Jamaica is in trouble. People are go dead. What if a people are go get wiped out? Blood are go run. God are go make plague take them. Everybody want to come at church for your breakthrough, the prayer of deliverance. But you have this something. You have it with you. You not left it go nowhere. You under strict order. How to use it? And if you not use it good, it not going to work, you idiot, you. And that are the trick. You need the blood of Jesus. You need a washing of the blood. Turn your life to God. I curse your curse. I know nobody I do you know. No. You're under curse. A dead you are dead. You abandon God and the men of God whom God sent to lead you. You know I'm led by no preacher. You know like pastors. The whole of them are thief and general. The whole of them are all wicked. And you curse me out and done with. Like them done Moses. But now the evil are kill you. You see him one around come here. We see a Mark Stewart. Where you nearly hey. You curse every string in me. You chat everything about me. But now the evil where you go walk I kill your granny you run come to me repent I did death before this Anna me not look friend then we are I hope you run mandible a science run mandible a large run business in a mandible I hope you walk in run you know I'm a preach what if I them here dresser what if I them barber and the business people them a fight against one another you black crab in a barrel you Chinese man are making money and I work together but you hate your black brother and your black sister so you walk up here to take them out of business God I will kill you the Lord said my son you know why it make me troubled because nowadays my, my, my spirit start get cross 
Come here, say, God, holy for people around come and fasting. They don't want God. They don't want Jesus. They don't want to get baptized. They don't want to get saved. Then dress up in a little like nastiness. And then come in at the church. They are come in at the church. One man of God to pray for them. But they don't want to have nothing to do with God. They don't like the man of God. But they still want deliverance. And I ask God to God how. Oh. And God said, tell them the truth. Tell them the truth. It now go away. People are going to kill you. Everybody around long prophecy. Everybody around long apostle. Everybody around long bishop. Everybody around long prophet. Lord, you know what I preach. But people know I run down Jesus. Because they know I surrender. They want quick fix. Everybody want visa. Everybody want man for my baby. Everybody want husband and wife. Well, some people nobody want that. Them just want man and woman in a bungle. You know what I preach? Everybody want to be healthy and wealthy, but they don't want Jesus. So when you don't have no money for your cobia, then you run to pastor. I use the church. You don't like me now. Where the pastor and bishop them where I say me a fast prophet. Listen to me now. Where the one them where I say Mark Stewart a hobby man. Listen to me now. Listen to the real preacher now. You know draw me out. You know I got no homies. Wall up, wall up, I know you preach against me. You know I don't know who me is now. You know I don't see me. My name is Mark Stewart. Demon chaser. Holy Ghost. Born again. Blood wash. Man of God. Who oh God bless. No man. On this rock, I build my and the gates up, gates up, gates up shall not. Yet I walk through the valley of the shadow of. I will fear no for the. A table before me in the presence of my thou anointest my head with my cup run it surely 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 can I prophesy the next state funeral won't be long Cause some people now here. Well on. I want to tell somebody in a parliament. Just the very mention. Where they mention Wobia. They might go feel it. They might go dead for. Just the very thought. Of legalizing Wobia. Somebody I go dead for. Mark my word. I think I drew up me a make. Somebody say prophet, prophesy. Feel the Holy Ghost. God, I go make an example. Right in a Jamaica. Yeah. God is going to make an example of somebody in a parliament who are ramp with God, who are legalized orders that is not on the books that we have put off. They want to put on. God are going to make an example out of somebody. You don't say nothing. You don't know if you agree with me. 
But when you don't see it, you know we believe. Oh, you know what I preach? The Bible said, the Lord said, they are their gods who brought them out. Them not say a God again. Them give credence to their gods. Say a them gods bring them out. After what God do for them, you wicked you. Look what God do for you. Now you turn and I talk about your hobby man and your God, your politician and your God, your ring and chain and your God, the idol where you have your God, you go and burn. Let me stop preach. Somebody vex. Somebody say, preach more. Preach more. Hallelujah. God vex. God is vexed. The Lord said, I have seen these people. I have seen them. Touch your neighbor, say you can't hide from man. But you can't hide from God. God see you. God see when you go. God see what you have on. God see say in your purse. When you reach around the corner of the soul, you take your and put in your wallet and your purse. God see you. Cause you know I miss it. God said I have seen them. I have seen these people. Oh God. At that height you know. You think God may see you not true. You get up early, five o'clock and left, and look if your neighbor look by your sister, they must sleep life turn off. And you think say so you're gone. And you come back and put it something man do what you do and go back to your bed like like your name. Get up early morning, go nowhere. God see you. You tell your neighbor bye bye about you go away for a few days. You have trouble for a few I'll pack bag. Say so you go every weekend and you're gonna send Thomas for the weekend for two. You're gonna you know, go airport road, you go straight. You say I go mob here. I hear probably you turn off and go. But in North Coast and go St. Mary. You think God may see you? And how far in you gone? I hope you are you going to walk. God see you. What am I preaching that trouble you saw? What am I keep that trouble you saw? Big man. Big woman. Politician. Police. So I say, well, I know. Business woman, what make me preach in a trouble you saw? Where you said your Lord mouth, no for preacher. Where you call me? I'm me the troublemaker. Who be there? Say you troublemaker, Elijah. Why you do ya? When you don't like me, turn off your TV. Lock off your radio, you're not know, listen to me. Millions are listen all over the world. If you're not like it, catch a bus. You're guilty. You never see anybody like me in Jamaica. Because when some preacher preach for TV, them pretty up and nice up the message. Because them want to attract rich men and powerful men and women. Them want nice, nice people come out in church. Me no want up. You know what me preach. If you're in a hit, stay from me church. Are you repent? Are you go dead? You're not coming to my church with you. I don't know, bishop and preacher. We are nice up a message. Forget money, people. For come at your church. All of you are get. I edit your message, prim and proper. Cause you know what? Nobody say nothing about you and your sermon and your church. So you are nice up your message. Well, this I want can nice. Jeremiah said, "Me feel like fire. Shut up in my mouth. I can't keep quiet." 
Some people can't take me a Sunday morning. Then can't manage the heat. Touch your neighbor say, you can't take the heat. Come out of the kitchen. God said, move, make me anger burn. Because they have turned from me and my commands. And have worshipping now idol and making sacrifice. And said it is not God who delivered them. It is their God. What a piece of abomination. What a piece of corruption. Eternal Father, bless our land. Guide us with thy mighty hand. I don't want to change the hand to them now. Because Jamaica has become all religions welcome. Corrupt nation. I don't think we are going to get away with it. God said, move Moses, let me kill them. Excuse me, go on down, make me anger burn. But thank God, some of we are praying for some of you. If, if Mark Stewart is not praying for some of you, lay a hand past some of you, dead already. Judgment take you. All right, praise God, we're going to leave it right there. You know, God says, how long will these people treat me with contempt? He said, Moses, go. He literally disowned him. He said, go to your people. They're your people. They're, they're treating me with contempt. They have turned from the ways of God and they're worshiping their idol. I would have just destroyed them. You know Moses had to beg God not to just destroy the people. That is very detrimental when a nation and its leaders turn from the laws and the principles that govern our lives, which is God. This country is making a very dreadful, deadly decision to go against the will of God for his people by allowing themselves to be led by greed and finances and don't realize that in this crisis, what we need is to get together and pray and focus on Almighty God and ask him to remove this thing. But no, no, they ain't doing that. They ain't giving the church a chance hallelujah to stand up and to cry out no they're more interested to lock us down to keep us awiyad but awiyad we have a praise god hallelujah but nevertheless god is watching and what is that what i'm trying to say to you even though we can stay awiyad and pray there is a time when god wants the church to gather and if you take away all that time where the church gathers to praise God, the nation is in trouble. We pray that these people will have good sense and don't build idols, but let's keep on trusting the Almighty for a breakthrough in this pandemic. Father, we pray for this nation. Pray for the leaders that they will make godly decisions or else face the consequences. We pray for the people of the land that they will turn to you, God, and repent of our sins and our behaviors and our ways so that you can relent and hear from heaven and heal the land. Have mercy upon the people, God. Lord God Almighty, I pray that you will look upon those who call on your name and you will cover us under your blood so no weapon from against us will prosper. In Jesus' name. God bless you. Thank you for joining for the breakthrough. We trust that you took the information and you will be contacting us saying, man of God, ministry, breakthrough. We want to support you and keep you going in this time of crisis. We love you. God bless you. We're praying for you out there, our members and everybody, all our partners. We have you in our prayers. God bless you. Have a good and godly day, a great week in the Lord, and be blessed in Jesus' name. Amen.